Today, we've got a story that's as complex as it is captivating, touching on themes of love, loss, and the delicate dance of moving forward. Roloff Farms, a place that's much more than just land and crops. It's a backdrop for a family saga featuring Amy and Matt Roloff, whose journey from a united front to navigating life post-divorce has captivated many. Now, enter Karen Chandler, a figure who brings both new beginnings and echoes of the past as Matt's fiancé and the former manager of this very farm. The dynamics? As complicated as you'd imagine. Amy, at 61, opens up about the layers of awkwardness in working with Karen. It's not just about sharing space, it's about intertwining past and present, personal and professional. For me, it's still kind of awkward to meet up with Karen, Amy confides, hinting at a mix of emotions that surely resonates with anyone who's faced the challenge of moving on while staying connected. The plot thickens with a recent episode where Amy, alongside her new partner Chris Merrick, teams up with Karen and Matt for a cause dear to their hearts, a silent auction for the Dwarf Athletic Association of America. A noble endeavor, sure, but with these four at the helm, it's a recipe for drama, tension, and, unexpectedly, growth. Matt, ever the strategist, labels Karen as list-driven and Amy as a bit haphazard, shedding light on the stark differences in their approaches. Yet, this isn't just about planning an event, it's a metaphor for their approach to life and healing. Amy, ever the optimist, sees beyond the event's logistics, emphasizing the importance of community and the power of coming together for a greater cause. It's a beautiful reminder of what truly matters, even amidst the chaos of conflicting personalities and past hurts. Karen, skeptical of Amy's organizational skills, injects a dose of reality with her doubts about seeing a detailed plan come to fruition. Do I think I'll see an itinerary prior to the event? I mean, I got a 50-50 shot, she says, keeping us on our toes about whether this collaborative effort will indeed come together or fall apart at the seams. But let's zoom out for a moment. Amy and Matt's narrative is a rich tapestry woven with love, challenges, and eventual acceptance. Their marriage, spanning from 1987 to 2016, was filled with moments both sweet and sour, culminating in a divorce that set them on new, uncharted paths. Suspicions and heartaches marked their journey, yet here they are, finding a way to coexist, collaborate, and even cheer each other on towards new chapters in their lives. Amy's remarriage to Chris Merrick and Matt's engagement to Karen after years of dating are testaments to their resilience and capacity for renewal. This saga begs the question, can we ever fully heal from the past, or do we simply learn to live with its echoes? How do we navigate the complex web of moving on while honoring the memories and connections that shaped us? I'm eager to hear your thoughts, so please pour your heart out in the comments below. Let's discuss the intricacies of life, love, and the journey towards finding peace amidst the storms. And there you have it, folks, a story rich with emotion, complexity, and the undeniable strength of the human spirit. If this tale resonated with you, show some love by liking this video. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell for more deep dives into the lives of those who captivate us from the screen. Your support means everything, and I can't wait to bring you more stories that make us laugh, cry, and reflect. Until next time, keep shining bright, and remember, in the world of stars and stories, there's always a silver lining. This is Julie, signing off.